Hi there. In this short video, I'd just like to offer a quick tip for people that like to record videos with the phone, but who get a little bit frustrated by the fact that when you start recording, and this is especially visible in 720p mode, your field of view gets cut down quite considerably, and the camera appears to zoom in compared to the standard widescreen photo mode. In addition to that, some people, including one or two review websites, have also pointed out that photos captured during the video recording process don't share this same cropped appearance and therefore you can't actually tell what the photos look like until you stop recording and go back to look at them afterwards via the gallery. So just to demonstrate this I've got my 1x set up here in front of me and I've arranged a selection of cotton bobbins or cotton reels whatever you call them within the camera's visible frame. If I now hit the record button what you can see is that the camera seems to crop and discard much of the outer regions of the image. And just so that I can demonstrate in a moment the other problem that people have brought up regarding photos, I'll capture a quick photo before I stop the recording. So if I now switch to the gallery, you can see that I have a video with quite a narrow field of view, and if I swipe across, I have a photo with a comparatively wide field of view. That inevitably leaves two questions. A, what's causing this, and B, is there anything we can do about it? Well, the cause is actually the image stabilisation option, which is reserving pixels from the outer region of the sensor in order to use them for counteracting some of the minor effects of unwanted camera shake. What you can do, though, is trade that option for a better viewing angle. To do this, all you need to do is press the settings button and go down to video options. And here you can see that video stabilisation is enabled. If we now disable that and go back, you can see that if we start recording again, we no longer have the restricted view that we had before. In addition to that, any photos that you now capture during the video recording process will match what you physically see on the screen. Obviously, this is an either or situation though. You can't have the wider viewing angle and image stabilization at the same time, but I'd certainly recommend that you give it a try and judge for yourself whether or not the real world benefits of having stabilization enabled outweigh the benefits of turning it off.